Okay guys, what is going on? Welcome back to another video. Today's video we're going to be looking at Le'Veon Bell. Okay, running back for the Steelers. A guy who I, I respect. I've seen him, well I've actually, yeah I've done, no, no, sorry. I don't even know if I've done a video on this guy, to be honest. But I will. But this video is just going to cover his top 100 uh, little video here. It's got 5 minutes and 22 seconds to it. Let's crack into it, guys. We're nearly there. We are nearly there. Yes. Who'd you put at number one? Me. I have a little bias off of me. <laughs> <laughs> I would have done the same thing. What? Well, so every every player in the league has to vote for. The top for their top hundred players, or is it? The, do they vote for the top ten? Because I don't think I don't think a player could fucking. Or do they vote for their top player, their favorite player? Just one, or maybe five or ten. I don't know. Le'Veon Bell gets the ball. All lies are on him. You never know what will happen. Even as peers peak. Le'Veon Bell. I'm pretty sure every running back in the league likes watching him run. You know, one of my favorite guys to watch is Le'Veon Bell. You know, I watch Le'Veon, and he's been getting nothing but better each year. Hey, just watch! I tell you watch! I haven't really seen a running back run like him before. I mean, he's out there playing mad, and you know, in real life. Oh, I'm excited, man. He's one of those I'm excited. That you make on mad. When a guy's got the juice, Bang! The button for hurdle. B to spin. A to stiff arm, and X to dot. It can be maddening to choose his best run. I had a run against the Chiefs. Yeah, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. The ball in the backfield had a little bit of penetration. I still felt like I was patient. And then I ended up hitting the seam. That's probably my best run of the year. Now that is one thing I need to confirm. What does hitting the seam mean? What does the seam mean in American football? Because I keep saying, like, the seam route is a route usually played against a zone defense, okay? So it's not man on man, it's zone, in which the receiver runs at the edges of a defender's coverage. Okay, gotcha. So you're going to, between two zones that they're trying to cover, in which case they're probably not going to be able to work out fast enough which person is actually meant to be taking this guy. Or you just get through before either of them can get to you. Huh. Well, I'd say this guy would probably do that naturally. I bet he doesn't even think. It just happens. I ended up getting called back, but all my run style kind of in one run was that run right there. Let's go! When we played the Bengals, uh, when he gave a stiff arm to Drake Kirkpatrick. I want to see this. <laughs> Fuck yeah. He threw him down. Oh! Raves about his patience. It was crazy because the first time actually seeing him practice and, and run a ball last year, my first year, I was like, is it going to work in the game? Like, what is he doing? What has come to play today? He does things that nobody even thinks about when just waiting behind the line, just, just waiting. And it's like he went zero to 60 in a tenth of a second. Oh, that's so good. Okay, I'm in the B gap. He's going to kind of tiptoe into that A gap. I mean, if you think he's committed there, when you try to shed off and go, that's when he just kind of, boom. Isn't it amazing? It's eerie, right? How any moment he Ugh. can press through the line. And, and Love this off. shit. I mean, I don't know how you do that. The best attribute of a running back is his vision. His vision is definitely, you know, part of the best. But his vision, uh, a lot of times you see guys coming that they don't think he sees. Defenders think that he doesn't see you, uh, but he sees you. He sees you. You know, I think the best thing I do is kind of like help my blockers out. Left Bell did everything possible a running back could do. 
Yeah. It's like a slow motion for him. He's just moving with it. Yeah, and he so. sees that opening, he's out of there. It's it. Like, the slow, game slows down for him. He's able to slow down the defenses. Like, you see him setting up for his cut lanes, and then he's able to hit the hole. Dead leg. And then he's explosive from that. He's a beast. How did he get past that? Are you kidding me, man? And the defenses. Like, you see him setting up for his cut lanes, and then he's able to hit the hole, and then he's explosive from that. He's a beast. Like, it's a real life beast. A real life beast. His peers have voted him the best running back in the game to death. Overall, he takes the fifth. Got a lot of rushing yards. That's a bang off the left if I ever did see one. I feel like running the ball, um, it kind of comes naturally, easy to me. Yeah bro, you could step into a rugby game and carve up for sure. Alright man, that was uh, Le'Veon Bell. The next one we've got Julio Jones, or Julio Jones, man. So many, far out, man. There's been so many, so many re requests for Julio Jones. It's been unbelievable. So finally, guys, we're going to get to it, all right? This video has been pretty short. But actually, what I do want to work, I, I, I want to know, um, I want to know, Livion Bell, Bells, what the fucking hell, man? My spelling is... Seriously, lacking right now. Six foot one. All right, so he's a, he's he's my height. He's 102 kilos, 225 pounds. He went pick number 48 in 2013 draft. He's made three Pro Bowls, and he ran a 4.640. But I gotta say, I mean, I bet I bet that's probably a little bit less than what he can do. 31 and a half vertical jump, nine foot 10 inches broad jump, 24 24 reps bench press. I'm not going to lie, guys. I'm not going to lie. I, 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 I'd be quite confident that I could get those, those numbers, except for the bench press. And my weight is less. So, huh. I don't even know why I just said that. I just said that I could do the same as the fucking top running back in the NFL. I have a habit of saying that sometimes, but I, I, I'm passionate and I'm, I'm honest and open and transparent, and that's what this channel is all about. If I see something that I want to talk about or say something about, I'll say it. And if it's unreasonable, you guys usually pull me up on it. So anyways, guys, if you have liked this video, please press like. If you want to subscribe, please do. And I'll see you guys back here for number four. Number four in the top 100, which is Julio Jones. <laughs>